This is going to be a lot of overwhelmed damage coming in that they can't kill yet. Okay, well that... That still would have killed Draven either way. And welcome everybody here in Twitch chat and everybody on YouTube for some All In Draven, our first of four meme tier Monday decks on this Monday. We got four really cool viewer submitted decks uh, bringing some freshness to the format. First one here, All In Draven, and this deck is all about Draven. It's our only champion. Yeah, three out of six. So, yep, we just got three Dravens. We are going to be using a Draven's biggest fan to help find it. But only one because we're going to have Rite of Callings as well. And so the Rite of Callings will kind of destroy it. Like, we'll have Ancient Preparations on one, look for Draven. And then on round three, uh, the Clockling will appear and we'll destroy the Clockling to go to go draw Draven. It's all about Draven, right? We got three Soothsayers in here to protect Draven. We got triple survival skills protecting Draven. And we're just going to attack a bunch. And we're going to use our spinning axes to level up Draven. They'll keep on getting more uh, spinning axes and everything like that. We're going to have the Absolver help us out because it should be fairly easy to level up Draven. We'll have a Grappling Hook for whenever we target it. Um, bunch of Whirling Deaths, right? So it's all about like attacking with Draven, Whirling Death stuff away. Because then even whenever we have Draven in play, we can still ride a calling for more Whirling Deaths. That's the thing is like if you have a Draven in play, when you Draven's biggest fan doesn't do anything anymore because you don't you already have Draven. But ride a calling can get you more Draven, some more Whirling Deaths, and then we want more uh, more attackers or just more attacks in general. So Ruined Reckoner creating these midnight raids. Ally starts a free attack, so we can have Draven get more attacks in just like that. And then we'll have Rune Runner and Siphoning Strike to grow the Draven. So that's that's what the deck is. It's all Draven all the time. Arena Bookie is pretty cool because, you know, with, with Draven, you create all those spinning axes. Well, what if you want extra cards instead of spinning axes? There's Arena Bookie. So round start, we'll discard those zero mana spinning axes and draw more cards. So it's definitely a meme tier deck. Pretty cool. This is all in Draven. We'll be, we're going to go play five games in a normal. All right, so we got Draven Ezreal to start with. This is going to be an important uh, survival skills matchup. All right, nice. We got survival skills. <clears throat> Let's get rid of all these. I can see keeping the bookie. Bookie should help us find Draven if we can't find Draven. Ruin Runner. Okay, there's there there's the Draven. So say Ruin Runner does have that spell shield, which is pretty cool. Okay, so I'm thinking that I won't be playing. Yes, give me another survival skills. I'm thinking I'm not going to be playing the Arena Bookie. <clears throat> I'm just going to save this two spell mana for now. Arena Bookie can be later if we have like a bunch of spinning axes later but it's not something that we need to do right now. Cool. I will definitely take another Draven. It's Draven time. Because we all know it's Draven time. Now we're cooking. Okay. So we traded the Spinning Axe for two Get Excited. So I think they, they discarded a Get Excited, it looks like. Let's do this. Now, of course, I don't have another Spinning Axe right now to save that Draven. But I got another Draven. We don't have to cast the Ride Calling also. It, it can be a discard fodder for the Arena Bookie. So if I play Ruin Runner, Ruin Runner will be the thing that we will survival skills, not the Draven. Let's maybe play some Arena Bookie. Where's my money, Bookie? Draven, good to... Let's talk at... I don't know how this is going to work. This is going to be kind of crazy. So we'll get rid of the Spinning Axe and... Uh, 
We'll discard both of these, Spinning Axe and Ride of Calling, which is not great for my survival skills, but we're going to get new cards. Axes coming right up. Very nice. We got another Spinning Axe. That's very nice. Humanity is obsolete. Hmm. Seen tombs, towns, and everything in between. So we'll discard Spinning Axe and Ancient Preparations. Yeah, so now Draven won't get Survival Skilled. But yeah, I'm going to keep discarding these Spinning Axes. Basically what I'm doing is just trying to get a whole bunch of cards. Right, I think that's like my plan right now. We do need another pump spell for the Draven. Out here, you're moving or you're dead. I think I'm just gonna be like hard casting the survival skills next round and attacking with like all these things that can't, you know, because then it's all all my allies. Yeah, I could survival with the with the first axe, but then I just feel like this is gonna be a better use of survival if I just wait and do them. And I'm just going to discard the Draven's biggest fan, draw a new card. The old Out with the old. Dang, I wanted that Absolver. Seen tombs, towns, and everything in between. Saw that a mile away. This is going to be a lot of overwhelmed damage coming in that they can't kill yet. Okay, well that that still would have killed Draven either way. This attack with this arena bookie may not be that worth it. Okay. Well, that works. They they blocked these two incorrectly. These two should be going the other way so that the, the bot puts this arena down to one health. Like, they could have just had this arena bookie at one health also. What's up, El Greco? A video two with the new cards? Yeah, there yeah, they're usually each day like some new videos with, with the new cards. Um, I have not looked at them too much. But, uh, yeah, they do a good job explaining them and stuff like that. But, yeah, we made that YouTube video with, with the new cards. It was definitely really cool. All right, so do I want to go get a new Draven? Will pay for what they did to us. I got 19 cards left. Free attack. You shall go no farther. Father. Inferior design. Whoa. I command you to halt. Halt. Okay, so if I, I I don't have like the other we won't have the other absolver, of course, right? Okay, cool. I guess they're you know, these ruin runners are just gonna take over. So I was going to play the Absolver, that's what I determined. So the Absolver is going to put him down to one, and then I was going to go get a new Draven and play the new Draven also. That was an awesome survival skills though, right? Like allowing us to attack with all those Rune Runners, and none of them die to the 4-3s. That was a great survival skills. Okay, so we'll have... Oh, Jarvan Shen's going to be challenging my Draven and stuff. We're going to mulligan the Ruin Runner, but I think we keep everything else. Okay, well, there's a Draven right there. So I was going to say, like, this is our combo to find Draven. Good, I like Whirling Death. Grappling Hook? Hmm. 
Yeah, we've talked about Poppy a few different times. Um, it's an it's an okay champion. It's it's not just like a super overtly cha powerful champion like a Viego, which I'm I'm glad for. I'm glad they didn't just keep printing those kind of champions. Time for the main event. Um, so I think it's a, I think it's a good power level. It's not going to be it's it's going to be like a probably a pretty average champion, and I think that's good. So not expecting them to block. Let's do this. Wash away all the troubles you. Looks like I'm ready. Bye bye. Time for the money makers. I want to level up Draven. That's what I'm doing right now is leveling up Draven. I actually did not see the the pop the poppy champion spell. I didn't actually see that. Okay, nice. Leveled up Draven. Gonna get some more Whirling Deaths. All right, so I got Draven with two Whirling Death for protection from like a a Screeching Dragon or something like that. Or a Jarvan. We're using a whole lot more cards than they are. Poppy is definitely playable. Like giving permanent permanent buffs to like your whole team every time she attacks of like everything that's smaller, that's that's really nice. Like Poppy is not unplayable at all. Oh, they have Nopify? Alright, well. Nopify is not so good for me. The party has arrived. Water changes, but never breaks. Time for the money makers. I want to clear up the hand just a little bit. But we want to have a lot of spinning axes for the like double attack ability of like Ruined Reckoner. I will fight for Demacia till the day I die. What? That's odd, right? Huh. Maybe those other guys. Hmm. Whatever. Yeah, so Draven should have been dead there, but we had the we had the we had we did have a biggest fan to go grab a new Draven. So like if they would have done that correctly, Draven dies. I um I play Ruined Runner and Biggest Fan that round. And then the next round I can play Draven and Reckoner, and I have a million spinning axes, and maybe between 
uh, Ruined Reckoner and Draven Overwhelm and a million sp spinning axes and a free attack. Maybe with all that, maybe we could have won. I'm not sure. All right, anyway, we got Yasuo Swain with the stuns. Oh, I don't like that. I don't like a bunch of stuns on my Draven and recalls. Oh, gross. I don't know exactly what I'm going to look for here. Like, this is a meme tier deck for a reason, right? Like, it's it's going to be, it's not that difficult to stop a single Draven. Okay, okay. Don't let the fluffy tails fool you. Why would I ever let the fluffy tails fool me? Soothsayer is nice. I like that. Sit tight and shut up. Underestimate. I dare you. I like the soothsayer. Ooh, and then arena bookie. Okay. Protect our prosperity. Watch and learn. So I can level up Draven this round by going Spinning Axe, Vision, and then either Grappling Hook or... Time grappling Hook or Siphoning Strike. Twin Disciplines. Wow, all right, that's a leveled up Draven. No name? Deny, no Nopifying. No Yasuo still. Oh, where's my money, Bookie? Draven, yeah, Bookie. Uh, let's talk at Probably a recall card. Watch and learn. Wanna see these moves up close? Time for the money makers. Just two mana. Oh no. I guess they didn't. Maybe they forgot about the spinning axes. Ooh, Brothers Bond. Let's do this. Ease your worries. Uh, you can attack too. That's fine. All right, let's go ahead and use a Whirling Death. Come out and play. Create some more Spinning Axes. Hmm. All right, good. Because so, I think it's like a random card out of, so it would've been like a random card out of the zero mana cards that would've discarded. Let's go Brothers Bond on these two. And a Siphoning Strike here. Make some more Spinning Axes. Alright, so nine. Now we're cooking. That's eight. Nine. All in Draven is pretty sweet. <laughs> That's pretty awesome. Now we just make more spinning axes and we discard those and draw real cards. 
Yes. Spell shield the Draven. <laughs> oh, that's gonna be game. That's gonna do it. Damn, I'm good. <laughs> Dude, that was sweet. Oh, we got a go hard deck. Go hard decks are good at killing stuff usually. So they should be pretty good at killing my Draven, I would think. So gone, 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 gone. Okay, no Dravens here yet, but we got the Agent Preparations to help look. And that can look for Draven or the Rite of Calling. Oh, there we go. There's a Draven. Very good. I kind of think I want an Arena Bookie. Yeah. We're going to need that card advantage that Arena Bookie provides, but we don't want to play it right now. It's, it's for a later after Draven kind of thing. Alright, cool. We got backup Draven. It's for like a round four. Round four Soothsayer plus Bookie. Good. Two spinning axes. This is probably gold card to kill Draven. Never lost a fair game or played one. Yep. So I can absolve her and make it a holy partner. Get a little bit larger. Doesn't seem worth it. Time for the main event. I feel like we just go towards protecting the new Draven. Yeah, there's three survival skills. Yep. We share the water's fortunes. Gotta go with the flow. Got axes, need victims. Time for the money makers. Just run while you can. Okay, so first part of leveling up Draven. It's not gonna be super easy to level up this Draven. Go on then. Watch the ball, folks. Whoa. There are some ruin runners. Am I going free attack or maybe just playing a Ruin Runner? If I just play Ruin Runner, then we discard our other Spinning Axe, and so therefore it's going to be really tough to level up this Draven. Noxus will pay for what they did to us. I kind of think I have to go this route. Let's boogie. Going. Always glimpse. Yeah, maybe I should have tried leveling the Draven the last round. Is that ruination? It doesn't tell us. Oh. 
I guess I need to do this first. I was planning on doing this after combat, but I guess I should have done that first. I should have done that immediately. That was my after combat plan. Should have done that immediately. My bad. Now their future Twisted Face will be leveled up, and that's really bad. But come on, we're playing a meme tier deck, we're, we're expecting to go like 5-0 with this Draven deck. <laughs> it's, it's pretty easy for Gohard to get rid of uh, spell shields between you know, Twisted Fate red cards and just regular Gohards and Mega Rains and... They're good at getting rid of spell shields. Right, calling. The Seen tombs, towns, and everything in between. Where do you stand on cold shots? Wash away all that troubles you. All right, that's the last glimpse beyond at least. Okay, good. Burn two Gohards. I'm happy about that. That means they got, they still got plenty more, but at least they burned two of them. Would I rather have Brothers Bond or Ride a Calling? So it's basically would I rather have Whirling Death or two things get plus two plus zero? And I guess the two things get plus two plus zero. It's more. It's more. It's two more damage on two overwhelm things. Oh man, I can't play everything. Pack your bags is you know the card that's going to kill everything. So I might as well play, I'm going to play this first because instead of just like attacking out first because they already have all the blockers they can have basically. So I just, you know, take up another 3-2. I'm down to 2. See if I had one more mana. One more mana. My money, my rules, oh, man. Vision. Okay. Get rid of those packet bags. Alright, so we know that they're going to be playing pack your bags next <laughs> alright so I'll have my two six ones try to finish this out Is there a reason to go get Draven first? 
Probably not, right? Because I don't think they're playing Withering Whale, but cool. Because, like, Withering Whale, Make a Rain, those either of those two cards would have saved them. But if I go get Draven first, they could, it's more likely they have a lot more Gohards. Alright, so I guess we are 4-0 and oh in normal with all in Draven. We've had some opponents that made some mistakes. That, that can definitely happen in normal. But as y'all know, if we are ever 4-0 and oh in normal, then we head on over to ranked for game number 5. So let's try uh, all in Draven and ranked. I didn't think we would get here, but here we are. Alright, we got Misfortune, Gangplank, so Pirate, Aggro. Can we race a bunch of Pirates with Draven? Okay, no Dravens here, and I think I can just discard, or like, send everything back. We could keep a Bookie to just block and trade with like a Legion Grenadier kind of thing, like they, they attack on two. I think I'm just going to send it back though, because I really want to find Draven, of course. Okay. I would rather have that bookie over, like, the second ride of calling. Okay, here we go. What do we find? Let's grab this biggest fan. Maybe the soothsayer. No, I kind of want to grab the biggest fan. I mean, the thing is, like, all these these Ride of Callings are not very good. But the biggest fan will get me Draven, but I can also, like, play a blocker, right? Like, that's what I want, is I want a blocker this round. Yep, for Grenadier. So that's perfect. I want to be able to block Grenadier. That is what I wanted. We can still go get some whirling deaths. War Mesa, reporting for duty. For the glory of Noxus. Hmm. Yep, I guess we're gonna go get Whirling Death. Doesn't mean I only get four me into this round now, so I don't get two Whirling Death plus Absolver. If they don't break, they'll burn. Okay, ready. I guess they gotta make it rain. If they attack out with everything. I don't have to be worried about Make It Rain. Okay, they're not attacking out with everything. Alright, so I'm definitely doing this. You hoping they'll die of boredom? Maybe. Time for the money makers. Gotta level up this Draven. Ruined Reckoner, I like it. Let's do this. I won't like Noxion Fervor. That's like the card that if they have Noxion Fervor, that's gonna mess a lot of stuff up. Really hope they don't have Noxion Fervor. Just all right, cool. No Noxion Fervor. That makes life a lot better. I thought I was already perfect. Yeah, I saw the new Poppy card reveal, and I, I've been warming up to the card. It, the more I, I've thought about the card, the more I like it. At first, I was thinking it just gave him, like, plus one, plus one that round, but the fact that it's a permanent buff. I like it. I think the card's good. Alright, next round, hopefully, with, like, all these resolve. Absolvers like attacking, we should be able to kill them. The thing is, 
four, five. I'll have five mana. Let's grab another Whirling Death. So I'll have four mana now. And Whirling Death would cost three, so then the next round I'll only have five, which I kind of want six. I have eight. I could have, I could have eight if I don't play Whirling Death. Uh, I don't know if it makes Quinn viable again. I'm not sure about that. Yeah, that's an odd card to play right now. Oh. Okay. Clearing it out. This is gonna hurt for you. I only save one other life if I do this. Like that puts me to nine, this puts me to ten. The four three is gone. Don't stand against me. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Oh, actually, this is just too many. I have to use one. For the money makers. I mean, this game's not over, is it? Got axes, need victims. All right, so this does four. It's okay. No, I can play three of these. So yeah, we're good. Yeah, we're good. I was, I was. Oh, no, no, because no, the powder cake. Okay, so yeah, so Noxion Fervor still kills me, so it's basically, do they have Noxion Fervor or not? They keep on saying this GG's, so maybe that means that they're dead. Okay, that means they're dead. Like, why don't they just block here? I'm not representing that I have enough for lethal. I had the Absolver, so I did have it, but they didn't know about those Absolvers. Why don't they just block? I don't know, they were just resigned to their fate of dying to Draven. They just saw too many spinning axes. Their head was spinning. Wow. 5-0 all in Draven. I wouldn't necessarily expect to go 5-0 again. Um, but I think what we saw, though, with those games, the Draven is kind of a difficult card to play against. I think we saw a lot of people, um, you know, kind of make some mistakes or you know things like that like draven with all these spinning axes i don't know it's it's just kind of like the math is weird right like i think that's the thing and and so it could be a little bit difficult to uh, play against um but i liked it it, it did really well uh you know the right of callings look kind of weird but sometimes you just need a lot of dravens right because you just need those whirling deaths and everything and the ruined reckoner with the free attack was awesome uh, the ruined reckoner that is the ruined runner was great, especially with survival skills. I didn't really like the brothers bond, because um, I feel like I feel like with that card, um, you kind of want something to maybe protect Draven's health a little bit more. I could see playing a Shapestone, because that is the plus one health, and it's only one mana, and you have the ancient preparations also. So I could see doing that instead of the brothers bond, or another option could be sharpened resolve. Um, you know, that's another thing that you could use to, I think I'd kind of rather have that kind of thing than, than just like the two plus twos with that brother's bond. Um, maybe even like a might, uh, so for like when you don't have a leveled up Draven or just an elixir of wrath, it's really cheap. I kind of like all of those cards over brother's bond. And so whichever one you like the most, um, kind of wouldn't mind any of those. Um, I could see playing like a, a bloody business. Get you another, instead of that Brother's Bond, get you another way to strike. Because uh, all those different, like, strike cards are pretty good. Uh, we, which, you know, we have a lot. The Hook, the Vision, or sorry, sorry, the Hook, the Whirling Death, the, the Strike. Because we should be getting 5 Power Draven fairly easily in this deck. So I wouldn't even mind one of those. Or even, like, a Quicksand to kind of help out against Challenge or something. Give you a different interaction spell like that. I don't know. I just don't really like that Brother's Bond. So those are all different options. 
Um, or it could just be a third arena bookie. Actually, arena bookie was really good for us in a lot of games. It's like we're not playing arena bookie on two. We're gonna wait later until we have like the different spinning axes and stuff. But arena bookie was good against like the removal heavy deck. So could see playing another one of those. But anyway, that's enough on that brother's bond. It's not that big a deal. It's just it's like your 40th card out of 40, right? Like <laughs> it's it's not that big a deal. But all these three ofs, this this deck uh, performed very well. All right, but that's going to be it here for All In Draven. Those of y'all watching later on YouTube, hit that like button and feel free to leave those comments and let me know what you think of the deck or if you try it out yourself, how it goes for you. Love to see those comments. But that's going to be it here for our first Meme Tier Monday deck. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you for the next video.